I am watching you, Rodent. What's that supposed to mean? It is common knowledge that rodents hoard nuts, stolen technology, units. <sighs> okay. First off, I ain't a hoarder, nor a rodent. I know you have a stash hidden aboard this ship. Fetch it, now. There ain't nothing to fetch. Groot blew our stash on Contraxia, and the rest I gave to Quill and Gamora for the DAS Quarantine Zone access code. A likely story. Why don't you go bother someone else? I intend to. Open this door! I know you are in there, sentient tree! Do not think that I do not know what you are up to. Your rodent co-conspirator has clearly stashed his illicit units in there. I am watching you, tree. Well, well, well. Let's see if we can find some stray units in here. Really? Thirty-seven units? They appear to be 7,963 units short. If we intend to keep our ship, Peter Quill... I know, I know. We clearly... Need a plan. And reconsider my initial proposal. Oh, no, not Fin Fang Foom again. Yes, we should go after Fin Fang Foom. Drax, there are easier ways to get paid. Like, what about selling Gamora's crap? What? Oh, come on. You've been hoarding them stupid knickknacks ever since you first joined us. I mean, don't tell me they ain't worth nothing. The quarantine zone was always out on us. My figurines are not knickknacks. Huh, team's in trouble. Then you can't be bothered to make no sacrifice. For the mock I will sacrifice system. your head. And take us to the... Guys. I think we should hear our group for once. I am He says we should combine both ideas. Sell Gamora's trinkets to Fin Fang Foom. It is brilliant. Yeah, you know, the only problem with your plan is that Lady Hellbender only buys monsters, and you are not a monster. He's not. He's the sweetest, most. I am Groot. No, you don't. This ain't something you can pretend. I am Groot. Oh, yeah? You want monster? I'll show you monster! Whoa, guys! Groot, are you really offering to- No, no, he is not offering that, okay? It could work. So, Groot, I guess we could bust him out after. Absurd. Lady Hellbender seeks the monster within. A small, ugly one is clearly the correct choice. He's cruel, sadistic, and his soul is filthy and filled with rage. Monster Queen would pay a great sum for such a creature. Really? How great? How are you okay with this? Because I know what I am. And I know what he ain't. I am Groot. I vote we sell Groot. I honestly think Lady Hellbender will go for it. Yeah, well, I vote for not Groot. I also vote for the creepy little beast. Two votes each. Peter? Well, Rocket's definitely scarier on the inside. He's unstable and vicious and totally oblivious to the needs of others. <clears throat> okay, we, uh, we get it, Quill. The point is, is I think you'd make a fine monster. And we'll definitely need that tactical brain of yours to bust you out once you're in there. But just to be 100% sure, you're definitely okay with this. Uh, are you kidding? I can't wait to hold this over you. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Let's go sell a monster. Seriously, flying into that. You say the weather patterns of Seknarf 9 are tied to the temperature of this room. That's not how women work. Or weather. Anyways, I'm sure it looks worse than it is.
Commander's Fortress. Get us in close, Quill. I don't want to walk in this. Whoa! <laughs> yep, no problem. We're flying the wrong way. Nah, no, no, he's not flying at all. Guys, relax. Just one minor adjustment. <sighs> <laughs> Piece of cake. <sighs> you can't be serious. What? This way we can scope things out before we finish the transaction. We're like a hundred clicks from her base. You know how much I like scoping. Next nope. time, I'm flying. Monsters do not fly ships. Monsters do whatever they want. Don't you get all gloomy right now. Don't help. Because your constant complaining does? <laughs> you you are complaining about the short one complaining. We're all complaining. Happy? Hope that jacket of yours is waterproof. Okay, here we go. I haven't mentioned how much I hate rain! Hellbender's castle isn't even that far! That is not a castle. It is an impregnable fortress. So how do we impregnate it? Ask Peter! <laughs> Let's just get closer. We'll figure it out on the way. There is nothing to figure out. As beast merchants, we will easily gain access to Lady Hellbender. Good! We've already got a beast. All that's left is the merchant part. Good thing I put on my official merchant costume. There is no such thing. Right? The fact you ain't sure don't vote so good. Out! Hey, is my jacket all right? At least you got a jacket. Some of us are soaking here. Less whining, more walking. Hey! Stop complaining. The hardship will strengthen your spirit. We won't walk, we'll hike. It'll be fun. Woohoo! He might be trapped. We got this. Just don't fall and we'll be fine. Agreed. You must face Lady Hellbender's rage head on. Almost sounds like you want to get hit by lightning. I would not expect a Chitari trader to understand the underlying value. The underlying value of getting killed? Of being direct, you child of subterfuge. What is your problem? Lady Hellbender scoffs upon duplicity and dishonor. Your reputation is why she tests us. Drax, the war is on our side. Now, just try to accept it. Whoa! That was way too close. Well played, Lady Hellbender. So we're still doing this? Yes! should have gone to Maku 4. Hey, check out the old resistance ship. Things been shot to hell. No doubt by this one and her Chitauri friends. We weren't friends. Our uh, guys. 
I survived freaking half world. I think I'm scared of some little. Black! It's not alone. Get ready. I was getting bored anyway. Being fried by lightning wasn't exactly enough for you. from its nucleus. So that's what a monster around here looks like? We are outside Lady Hellbender's sanctuary. The creatures here are not her pets. They sort of do look like food. We're gonna be food if we don't climb out of here. Where the flark is she going? Husk should be easier to climb than the muddy terrain. I ain't comfortable calling it a husk, seeing as we're about to climb it and all. Clearly not a husk. Having fun? Didn't think I'd ever be shooting at a resistance ship. 
Drax, you could pull this reactor out gently, right? If it were combustible, the rodent would have shot it by now. He makes an excellent point. Now I continue ripping it apart. No, no, no. I think we're good. What's a resistance ship doing all the way out here anyway? Great. There they are! Wing controls! What does your magical mask reveal? Give me a second. What's taking so long? Peter Quill is... All right, Rocket. That wing control panel's all yours. Hope it still works. Great! Everyone watch out for beeping red lights. What? Why? This is a resistance ship. We'll be lucky if there's only one booby trap on it. That'll do it. What the flark? That don't sound like no jelly thing. They say that Lady Hellbender's call echoes throughout the planet. Careful! Looks like something big moved through here. Yay! If you see anything with claws the size of tracks, let me know. I thought we already had our monsters. What's she tracking this thing? <laughs> Just further proof that we are not welcome here. If we turn back every time we ain't wanted, we never go in. Good point. Through here, Gamora. Whatever it takes to find Hellbender. Her name is Lady Hellbender. Yeah, Gamora. If we want an audience with her, we will have to start showing some respect. This from the guy who calls me Harlot Spawn of Thanos. An accurate description. We all know which Harlot Spawn it first. And what about her sister Nebula? Guys, monster planet, dark, dangerous. Can we focus here? Are you frightened of monsters, Peter Quill? Only the scary ones. We'll need to find a way out of this jungle. Why? It's dry down here. What? Oh, dead end. That's just great. Wait, is that Chitauri tech over there? Ask the Chitauri. No, no, it is. It's a retractable bridge. They used them at the prison I was in. Too bad the controls are on the other side of the giant chasm. We what are you? We do not have time to dawdle in this jungle. I shall hurl the creature over the chasm so he may activate the bridge. I may activate a hole through your face! Put me down! We're not throwing rocket. Very well. You sons of fucking chogs! How will we cross? Scum, doom face. Look around, we'll find another way. Think these statues are of the monsters on this planet? Not a chance. We both know it's too far for you to stretch across. What's Chitauri Tech doing on a backwater mud ball like this? There has to be something we can do. Maybe it's smaller than big roots. be easier to throw the rodent. No, it would not. What if he breaks a leg? He would still have three. No one's throwing rocket. <sighs> no, the statues are not watching us. Do not be so sure. They say Lady Hellbender has eyes everywhere. Of course they do. Yeah, I'm fine. Just leave it. What's your problem? My problem is Meathead's trying to hug me over a cliff. You are overreacting. I did not throw you. Only because Quill stopped you. Then 
There should be no problem. I'm watching you. You could happy in psychopath. dark in here. If you bump into any monsters, let us know. Monster planet. Right. No, that aimless shooting isn't going to scare the monsters away, right? Hey, my shooting's not aimless. Everything I do is with purpose and, you know, heroism. Hey, I found more ruins down here. Ah, perhaps we could fashion a catapult. We're not throwing rocket. But maybe there's something else here. Drax, think you can topple this? Indeed. not to fall. That's your pep talk. Great place to leave a sculpture. Wait, hear that? Eyes up, people. Incoming! Yes, I know we're in a fight! Woo! Show him your woo! He think would have come in handy a second ago. And I shall remove their wings. Never see it coming! Enjoying myself! Watch the stingers! I'm watching the big Florky Fangs Fangs! Hold fast! Through Hold my turn! I'm starting to miss those jelly Fangs! I'm sure you'll see them again! To Lady Hellbender! I ain't riding something that wants to eat me! Hit him down, Drew! Anyone else notice this place looks like a graveyard? Focus on not becoming part of one! No, you don't let them grab me! What's in the shade? These things would have come in handy a second ago. I don't think that I'd let you ride them on the street. I will face all of the open Get it out of your system before we get there. Let's see them fly once they're dead! 
Enough of these inferior creatures. I yearn for monsters. Why are we so sure this is the way? The statues here didn't walk into place. They were carried. Carried? By whom? For what purpose? I thought you were supposed to be the Lady Hellbender expert. There was nothing in the pamphlet about statues. All right, Gamora. Pretty sure it's this way. 50 units, does it ain't. He doesn't have 50 units. No way are we almost there. Still got like half a planet to walk across. Lady Hellbender could cross this jungle in seven strides. Sure she could. Or she would have flown over the mountains. Oh, she flies now. Drax, some of your Lady Hellbender tidbits are questionable. You can say that again. Gamora, mind cutting us a path? You say that Lady Hellbender feels it every time you cut a piece of her jungle. Oh, an old Nova bomber. I haven't seen one of these since the war. I remember it used to take a dozen ships to bring one down. A dozen ships. Or one Chitauri infantry. I'll take that one as a compliment. Still no sign of the fortress? No. Nope. Are we even sure this is the right way? Yes. Now what's the hold up? Fear. No! Just thinking someone else should cross the death pit first. Me and Groot are the merchandise. Only one of you is the merchandise. Plan A and Plan B, okay? Anyone else feeling ready to move on? Groot says no. Just go. No, you just go. go! Don't leaders usually cross first? Not if it's dangerous. Because I need to cover everyone. Right. See, it's fine. Perfectly safe. Fine. Do not even think of pushing the assassin. There are so many better ways to kill someone. Easy does it. Groot says there's something down there. A monster. It doesn't matter. Of course it matters. It's unstable either way. Just move. 